Good day mga kasabong. Let's talk about hen and the male sex chromosome. Hen is the carrier of male sex chromosome. Bago ka mag-breeding, dapat marami kang alam tungkol sa breeding para kunti lang masayang na pera at panahon. Dapat disidido ka kung gusto mong mag-breed, sabi ni Boy Primalyon. Famous of the Sambangawai. Kung gusto mo na maging magaling at scientific na breeder ka, dapat may kunting alam ka sa genetics. Ano ang genetics? Genetics is a discipline of biology. It is the science of heredity. This includes the study of genes and the inheritance of variation and traits of living organisms. More informally, genetics is the study of how parents pass some of their characteristics to their children. So, hindi ka pwede mag-breed kung hindi mo alam ang genetics. Ang genetics ay nagsa-study kung paano mapasa o mapunta ang kanyang mga katangian sa kanyang anak. So, dapat may kunting alam ka sa genetics. What is a gene? A gene is the basic physical and functional unit of heredity. Genes are made up of DNA. So kung gusto mo mag-aral ng genetics, kailangan malaman mo kung ano ang genes. Ano ang ibig sabihin niyan, ano yan, at saan yan makikita. Saan makikita ang genes? Genes are found on on tiny spaghetti-like structures called chromosomes. And chromosomes are found inside the cells. Your body is made up of billions of cells. Cells are the very small units that make up all living things. So, ang bawat manok o tao, ano dyan, ang nag-compose sa iya o Uh, ang se- ang nagmakikita sa buong katawan niya ay ang cells at ang sa- ang cells may genes. Ang genes ang cells ay maraming parts. Isa na 'yon ang genes. Ang genes amo ang responsable sa heredity o sa katangian ng isang manok o tao o ano man diyan ng mga animals and, and plants. Ano ang halimbawa ng cell? Bakit ang cell? Usually, di makikita ng mata. Kailangan ng microscope para makita ang cell. Ang itlog ng manok ay isang halimbawa ng malaki na cell. Ang itlog ng manok, example ng cell na malaki. Parts of a cell. No? Ito ang cell. Ito ang, ang puti, tawag cytoplasm. Yung yellow, yung ang nucleus. So, ang cytoplasm, marami yung mga parts ang cells. Dito makikita yung mga mga bagay-bagay na nagtutulong na mag-develop ang nucleus. Uh, ang nucleus parang ano siya, ng, uh, ito ang master, ito ang utak, ito ang naga, nagkakontrol o ang dito nang nanggagaling ang mga kasarian ng isang living things. Saan makikita ang genes? Doon sa loob ng yellow or nucleus. Dami-dami klaseng genes ang sa loob ng nucleus. Doon makikita ang genes kung rooster or hen ang lalabas ng mating. Sa tao, ang sex genes ay XY chromosome. Sa manok, ang sex genes ay CW. Ang genes ay pares pares. So, sa, sa hindi lahat na na genes ay for sex determination. So, meron ang genes doon para sa kulay, sa lipad, sa mga kat- sa taas o sa body configuration. So, ang genes amo ang nag-dictate. Yun parang computer siya. Nag-dictate na ito ang, pag ito ang magsama-sama, ito ang mangyari. Paano naging babae o lalaki ang humans? So, sa genetic point of view, ang male, ang sperm niya, 
carrier yon ng ang male carrier ng X and Y sex chromosome. Ang sa babae, X, X, or double X. Pag sila nagmate or cross, haps ang X, Y, either X or Y, ang laman ng sperm, tapos hap sa itlog ng babae, so, ang babae double X, so, X talaga yung mahahati dyan. So, ang X ng babae at mag sama sa X ng lalaki, ang labas, XX, or ang kanilang product ay babae. So, alimbawa, sa lalaki, pag ang nakuha ng sperm ay Y chromosome at mag mate o mag uh, cross sa itlog or sa, sa ubari o itlog galing sa ubari ay X pa rin. So, mag mate ang X and Y magsama-sama maging lalaki. XY. Pero, iba sa mga manok. Iba ang sa manok. Halimbawa, ang lalaki na manok, ang sex genes niya ay Z, Z, double. Ang female, ang sex chromosome niya ay ZW. So, ang, kung mag-mate sila, half ng, ng sperm ng male ay Z, at ang half ng egg ng female ay Z rin. Pag nag sila at nag-cross, ang ilaanak ay lalaki, ZZ. Halimbawa, pag ang sperm ng, ng manok, ng rooster, ay Z rin, at mag-mix sa, sa female, kag ang carry ng egg ay half na W, ZW, ito maging babae, yung anak. So, sa tao, always remember na ang sex chromosome ay XY. Ang sa babae, ang sa, sa manok, ang chromosome ay ZW, ang sex chromosome. So, kung half dito na Z ng baitlog, magmix sa half na Z ng, ng manok, ang anak ay male. Yung sa kabila, if ang half ng W ng female, magmix sa Z na half ng sperm. Ang anak ay babae. When cells in the bird ovary undergo the special kind of division called meiosis that produces eggs with just one set of chromosome, its egg cell receive either a Z or a W. Fertilization with a sperm, all of which bear a Z, produces a ZZ male or ZW female chicks. So the sex chromosome for the chick chickens are ZW. So if the resultant offspring have ZZ, it is male. And if the resultant offspring of sex chromosome of ZW, it would be a female. In mammals, females have a matching pair of sex chromosomes. XX, if female, while male carries two different ones, XY. In chickens, the situation is reversed. Males have a matched pair of Z, meaning Z, double Z or ZZ chromosomes, and females have a ZW set. Scientists have long thought that most evolutionary change or in the chromosome found only in only one of the sexes, the W and the Y. The Z is the large is a large and carries the key candidate testis determinant in chickens. Sex linked genes and false are genes and the Z chromosome. Roosters have two Z chromosomes and hence have only one Z chromosome plus one W chromosomes. As the hens only have one sex link allele for any given lupus, both determinant and recessive sex link genes 
are expressed with just one gene as hemizygous. A gene is a basic unit of heredity in a living organism. Genes come from our parents. We may inherit our physical traits and the likelihood of getting certain diseases and conditions from a parent. Genes contain the data needed to build and maintain cells and pass genetic information to offspring. How many chromosomes are present in chicken? The chicken karyotype consists of 39 pairs of chromosomes, which is typical of most avian species. The genome is organized as 8 pairs of cytologically distinct macrosomes, the Z and W sex chromosomes, and 30 pairs of small cytologically indistinguishable microchromosomes. A karyotype is, is an individual's collection of chromosomes. So, the term na sa genetic, a karyotype, the whole sum of chromosomes. Which is the male genotype in the ZW chromosome system? In XY systems or in humans, males are heterogametic or XY and females homogametic or double X. Whereas in chickens, in ZW systems, female are heterogametic or ZW and males homogametic or double Z. Homo means one, hetero means uh, not, different, not the same. Less well known is a third system of sex chromosome system. How many chromosomes are in chicken sperm? Important information for understanding sex linkage. Chickens have 78 chromosomes. That is, they get 39 chromosomes from its parent. And one of those is a sex chromosome. The albion sex chromosomes are Z and W. So either Z or W sex chromosome is in inherited from its parent. In humans, it's the sperm that determines whether an embryo is pushed along a male or female development pathway. But in birds, it's the other way around. Eggs are the deciding factor in bird sex. There are other fascinating aspects of bird sex that are not shared with humans. Female bird seems to have some capacity to control the sex of their chicks. In humans, cells in females have two copies of a large gene-rich chromosome called X. Male cells have one X and a tiny Y chromosomes. Birds also have sex chromosomes but they act in completely the opposite way. Male birds have two copies of a large gene-rich chromosome called Z, and females have a single Z and a W chromosome. The tiny W chromosome is all that is left of an original Z, which de degenerated over time, which much like the human Y. Birds can control the sex of their chicks. We would expect that during meiosis, random separation of Z and W should result in half the chicks being male and half female. But birds are tricky. Somehow the female is able to manipulate whether the Z or W chromosome gets into an egg. Most bird species produce more males than females on average. Some birds produce different sex ratio at different times of the year, and others respond to environmental conditions or the female's body condition. Maybe this is somewhat true to chickens. It makes sense for females in poor condition to have more female chicks because weak male chicks are unlikely to surmount the rigorous of courtship and reproduction. How does the female does it? There is some evidence 
she can bias the sex ratio by controlling hormones, particularly progesterone. How male and female birds develop? In humans, you know it's a gene on the Y chromosome called SRY that kickstarts the development of a testis in the embryo. The embryonic testis makes testosterone and testosterone pushes the development of male characteristics like genitals, hair, and voice. But in birds, a completely different gene called DMRT1 and the Z but not the W seems to determine sex of an embryo. In a ZZ embryo, the two copies of DMRT1 induces a ridge of cells, the gonad precursor, to develop into a testis, which produces testosterone a male bird develops. In a ZW female embryo, the single copy of DMRT1 permits the gonad to develop into an ovary which makes estrogen and other related hormones a female bird results. This kind of sex determination is known as gene dosage. Research done by Dr. Ray J. Libakin. If you like to hear more updates, please subscribe and click the notification bell and share. Thank you.